What's going on guys, it is your favorite monkey and welcome back to Factorio and today we are going to work on our blue circuit production or its better name, processing unit. Yeah, the blue circuits. So we got our green, red and blue. As we can see, the processing unit, the blue one, requires just like 20 greens and two advanced circuits and some sulfuric acid. So, uh, been watching a YouTuber doing his own thing over here like uh, sort of following what he was doing and um, yeah apparently this might not be enough to, well not for massive scale but a large scale if I can put it that way uh, to create some blue circuits so what I did was I took this idea and this idea and combined them into a like it's just uh, something a bit more bigger, okay? So what I'm doing here is getting the iron off onto these transport belts all the way to this line and turning them into iron plates and using this coal over here. And I don't have radar coverage here, but this copper ore it goes into something similar, like literally, rich, literally copy and paste. So the one is iron, the other one is copper, and that goes into, well, this line, okay? Now what that is, is basically a replica of this, but on a much bigger scale. There are two, four, six, twenty. Twenty over here, and I think twelve over there. So twenty of those productions over here, and those go on belts, the green green ones go on here they go upwards to the red production with the copper as well just a reminder that there is some copper coming along here as well um, to 12 of these which is literally three of these like three times the output okay and these guys have their own plastic line so uh, what I did was I split this like from there to there it's a bit hard to see with that yeah, even that. Ah, there we go. Much better. So half of that goes into one. The other half goes into the other one. And they will produ be producing some red circuits for us. You can see it is um, backlogged. And I had to change some of the blueprints just to make the reds go a different way. So the inputs, um, all the outputs, they all come out on the same end. If I can put it that way, or just one output, and inputs come on in the other end. Okay, so today we are going to focus on the blue production. If we just go quickly drive over there, and I can show, just, you know, just give a little showcase on how it everything looks like. If we go here, so there's the copper, there's the iron, they all get combined to here. And man, this just looks beautiful. Don't you guys agree? I think it looks stunning. So... It will come down here and it's becoming dark. I should really install lights everywhere. And being processed into green, the green and the uh, copper comes upwards to here. And they get turned into red as well. And I brought the red and green coming up here as well. So over here, near our oil production, is our blue production. Right here. Okay, so we have the assembling machines too, as, of, as far as I understand you can only make these in assembly machines 2 and number 3, so there we go, that, 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 so in the center we have our sulfuric acid running down or up, doesn't matter, um, I have all the inputs and outputs going same direction from the bottom to the top, and um, yeah, so I think, trying to remember now, I think the red goes in the center, and the blues, yeah, I don't, uh, I don't know. So let us go ahead and get some power to here. Like, I would say up until there, just the maximum reach. That, another maximum reach to 
there and just you know another extra one like that okay so these guys are powered but that's not gonna help us what I want to do is get this guy going so it does need the power so let's just go ahead and give it to him and let's see if we can out continue this line mm, up until here like that big power pole big one I said baboon let's give it maximum reach that and like that the reason why I'm doing this is so that my bots can go ahead and do the construction for us and I want to plop down a few more of this these blueprints so I think it was this one that's correct oh, well, where are we being attacked show me oh how did they they probably sn snuck in from there yeah you know what okay no you know what they are small bases like this there's probably a few more along this line being tickled by pollution it might be that although yeah I think there might be a base there because it's being sucked up pollution is being sucked up and there as we can see there's not a lot of trees there I could be mistaken okay so this one you want to turn you like this and let just the power poles align like that and that how many is that one one uh, yes one two three four five six seven let's go about to eight and i'm going to give myself some expansion again ah there's a little bit of a wall missing there lol so i'm going to leave myself some room to scale up if need be like so there we go and does that cover our logistics range and construction range and all the ranges of the range okay let's go ahead plop one down there let's get you to i would say here and then here just to give ourselves a gap over there why did i go and do that there There. It's so hard to place with this thing. It looks like it does, It won't have power and whatnot. Okay, so that is coming along quite nice. It's so nice to have bots. So nice. Just to be able to plop down the blueprint and let them get to work. Okay. So, another thing is we need to get sulfur into these pipes. Yeah, sulfuric acid. Or just, yeah, sulfuric acid. So it requires water sulfur and iron plates and we have actually a very small line over here doing exactly that so what we can do is we can kind of break off a line here of iron where do you guys get your iron from yeah see these guys are engaged. Yeah, we have to go see if we can sort that out very soon. But yeah, maybe we want to continue with this line. You know, just a couple of undergrounds. Come through this way. Maybe break it off there. I don't think that's... A problem. But yeah, so let's go ahead and... Blueprint this. Yes, this because all it needs is um, sulfuric acid. It's just the water input and the sulfur itself. Although we can just probably run off this because this is all backlogged. Hmm. Huh. But I want to do the blueprint thing. So let's go ahead. Grab from there. Actually, no. No. Let's just lay, lay some pipes. Get this going in a different direction. 
So all we need is a couple of our grants and let me just put in a request for a hundred of these and a request for a hundred of those. That is fine, I hope. And hopefully this will be enough to get that production going. Let's just do that. Let's grab a normal pipe over here. Uh, where is... Oh, it's doing a thing. And I don't like do it doing that thing. But that... And there. Grab that pipe, put it there. So we're just gonna run off from here. Up until there. Please and thank you. Just like this. There. Let's grab... Nope. That pipe. There. And like that. So we just run you all the way downwards. And let's just put one there. So that we can expand if need be. And like that. Yeah, I don't think this is gonna work out. But it's okay. I will just dabble with it offline or off camera. There we go. And let's just do that. Okay, so you guys are all filling up. And I hope this makes enough production for us. I really do hope so. So now what we want to do is... Wow, it's dark. Why is it so dark? Mommy. <laughs> uh, what we can do is... what The other thing we can do is just make some local production over here. Or here, maybe. And feed it directly into there. Which is also a thing. We can run off these tanks. I mean, they are here. They are, they are full. Full, full, full of petroleum gas. Okay. I uh, just want to see how... Uh, hmm. We can try different ways. We can split it up to green on outsides and red in the center. So let's do the furthest one first. I'm going to run you down like this. So we just need one and two lines. So let us go down here. Do we have... Oh, that would be so nice if this connects. Just like that. You there and you there. Like that. There we go. Oh, I can't reach that. Under. Let's go grab this line. And I would say up until maybe here-ish. Yeah, it looks fine. Yeah, I knew it was going to move me. There we go. So red is going in there. Let us bring it down this way and make it nice and clean. Like that, that. Like so. And let's just grab this line. Then we can sort out the red circuits. Or the green ones. Whoops. How can you mess up a straight line? It's unbelievable. Oh, come on, baboon. 
the hell's wrong with you? I've been doing that whole day. So I just quickly want to see before we continue on that these guys grab. Yes, they did grab their reds. So let's get this one going for the one green. Now the thing is with the green. Oh, I don't like that trickling of stuffs. I do not like that. And why is only one side being... Yeah, I don't know. So this one needs to split into two. But we're sorting out the... F for the left one. Okay, so what we can do... Is... Turn this one this way. Okay, and just run on the belt. Which will make things a lot faster. And let's go up one more. Like that. And then what we do is we split these two and that just a small hop there we go just like that there we go now you guys are getting it. Oh, excuse me. So that is going very well. Let's just hook up the last few. Oh, my bots are bringing my belts for me. That is so cute. So what we can do... Let's go and... Yeah, I should have waited... Actually, but they will bring it for me as I'm working because I am in the logistics zone. They'll just go ahead and recharge at certain stations. Turn you to the right. And then we send you upwards. And don't forget to run on the belt. That will make you more faster. Um. So what we can do is over here. Let's bring it down one. Because you need to... Damn it, I hate the dark. Like so. Why am I changing his position now? There we go. Again, yeah, see now there is definitely a base there. I can smell them aliens. They're trying to destroy our masterpiece. But I shall not let them. They will know no mercy. I will show no mercy. Uh out of way. Oh, and I ran out. Uh, where are my bots? Are you guys not, like, gonna bring stuffs? Now we'll just have to wait then, I guess. But I want to get those blue lines on the bus as soon as possible. The blue circuits on the bus, uh, bus as soon as possible. You guys have to forgive me. English is not my first language. There we go. Bring me many, many belts. Now, if you guys were wondering on what our count is, logistics, 2,500. Construction, 2,300. So, yeah. <laughs> that is quite a lot. Quite a lot. Okay. So, how does, what's our time at? Okay, we still got so five minutes to go. And that should be plenty enough. Then now, if, if not, I will go sort that out myself 
off camera but i promise you guys i will do an episode where i just don't talk it's just some kick-ass music and we will just go ahead and destroy aliens but what i want to do is get to artilleries over here where is it there we go Ar artilleries i want to get to those things that and a personal robot port that is gonna help us a freaking ton just to wipe these aliens off and then also obviously atomic bomb we gotta do that we gotta use the atomic bomb because a good alien is a dead alien am i right yeah you guys know i'm right so let's go and uh finish this line real quick and it looks like you know the circuits it's not running as far as i wanted them to go yeah i probably have to see if i cannot expand oh you know what let's let, let that build up let that build up and then i'll probably go see if i can add maybe one or two more of those things because the co the copper and iron they are holding out what we can do just a little bit and if you guys didn't know i'm a little bit colorblind so if i'm messing something up i am messing something up royally with these colors but as far as I understand, this is green, that is red. If I can zoom in like this, I can almost clearly see the color differentials. But if I'm like this, it's... Okay, it stands a little bit more... I don't know. It's just hard, okay? It's hard. Okay, there we go. And what I'll do is let this run on its own. See, the circuits are reaching days, but it's because most of these guys... They've already produced, like these ones. They've grabbed these stuffs. And yeah, I just want to see. This takes, uh, how long, how long does it take to pr produce one? Craft time, 10 seconds, oh, there we go. So, 10 seconds, 20 electronic six. so that means I actually need 10? Electronic circuits. I don't know. I'll see if I can sort it out. But this looks like it should be enough. But it's coming in really slow. Really, really slow. And I mean, if you want one per second uh, of these recipe, uh, processing units, that means we need to have ten. And there's clearly more than ten here. It's so one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Already there. That that block. That block is ten. So we've got ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen times one, two, three, four. Sixteen times four. That's what we have. There we go. So five hundred units per hour for that. Which is good. It's good. Um, but yeah, okay, so that is all done fine and well. I'm gonna let this do its thing. But what I will do is the red is fine. The red looks like it is brilliant. It's doing its thing. It's the green that is the the issue. Oh yeah, no, look at that. That is the that's Is it because of the pollution? I uh, know, you know what? It, there must be a base there. So I'm gonna go and take care of that real quick. And, yeah, next time, uh, what you guys will... S I don't know what we're going to do next time. I, I will see what we will be doing. Um, but I'm going to do the science off-camera as well. Um, where is it? It must be this. Uh, the production and the utility science. So we can power through these, uh, these things. Then, yeah, we'll see if we can get some things set up and ready to go. You know, we want to get to the rocket silo. But yeah, that is it for me today, guys. Thank you so much for joining me here on Factorio. Hope you guys did enjoy today's episode. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.